What up boys and girls and air gun hunters out there in YouTube land? I got a good one for you today. Been tearing it up in the shop and out in the field. So I uh, just want to show you guys a couple new uh, things that we got cooking in the woods. So yeah, it's time to bring, bust out the crawl puncher uh, breaker. Been wanting one of these for a long time. And then uh, SG, Southern Gunner, Kenny, he uh, slapped one up on his uh, YouTube channel for sale and I picked it up off of him. And uh, yeah, this sucker, when I got it, it was well seasoned and well experienced. Let's just say that. It was ridden hard and put away dirty, but um, that's the way you're supposed to use this uh, particular model. Is uh, get, It's just supposed to be able to take a knock and handle the abuse. It's got the marine coating on there. And uh, I think Kenny thought that the marine coating was uh, uh, literally for marine use because at, at almost when I got this thing, it seemed like it had been... Uh, sunken under the ocean with the Titanic for like six months but uh anyways yeah we cleaned it all up put it all back together and uh, man uh, running the Terminator uh, kill can on there keep the sound uh, to a minimum uh, let me know if you guys want to get your hands on one of these uh, I tuned this up for the uh, uh, 19 and 20 grain Terminator slugs and uh, it runs them real hot I did a caliber conversion on this from 25 to 22 cal when I got it and uh, did some power mods, pushing about 40 foot pounds on it now, and uh, 22 cal. So uh, yeah, I'm really stoked on it. Um, <clears throat> swapped out the caulking lever for a, a spoon type, um, updated version, and uh, yeah, it's real uh, quiet. Put the kill can on there. Basically, just hear the uh, hammer spring hitting. So. Loving this. Did a uh, camo job on it. Let it blend in out in the field a little better. And then uh, just running a lightweight scope. This thing's real cool. You can carry it upside down. Carry it by the scope. Carry it under here. So I just really like how it has so many carry options. Um, it's really cool. Check out the footage. It's a laser beam with the uh, Terminator slugs and the kill can. The kill can uh, Terminator. Uh, this one's with the UNF threading. And um, I also have them available for uh, Air Venture Avenger and Origin threading for the shrouds. But um, these things are about one third the weight of an aluminum uh, uh, conventional um, LDC. So uh, really, it keeps the muzzle weight down. So when you're shouldering up, you know, it just keeps the muzzle weight down, less fatigue, and you can hold her more steady. So, um, but also, too, I've been like to the ear, it's like one third as quiet or uh, it's like one third more quiet and almost half more quiet than the smaller um typical ldcs so uh it's very quiet more quiet than leading brands i'd say that i've been using and then uh yeah it works real good and then um that I've been using in this video footage is uh, my Air Venturi Avenger tactical stock. And uh, on that I'm running a Terminator kill can as well. Um, keeps the muzzle super light. You know, uh, I got a 350cc uh, carbon bottle on there with the uh, Terminator Productions uh, barrel band got the picker up down there so you can mount your flashlight if you want to uh, and then yeah uh, this thing's 22 caliber uh, we shoot 19 grain terminators out of this 17.5 grain 20 grain uh, runs them real good over 900 like 915 920 feet per second depending on the uh, grains but uh, yeah this thing's real quiet as well Super quiet. So, uh, and then uh, another rifle I've been working on is the Avenger Bullpup 177 Cal. So I got some products out for uh, that. We got the uh, standard tube uh, for a barrel band for Avengers and Avenger Bullpups. 
and then the same uh, LDC on there. And then uh, this one's Calibrin 177, so it's like mouse fart, quiet, very nice. And uh, yeah, I'll get this thing out there pretty soon. Um, I haven't been able to take it out too much, but uh, just been working on it mostly and then uh, working on my other stuff. But uh, anyways, check out some of this footage and let me know what you think. And uh, we'll uh, <clears throat> get back at you pretty soon with some more, uh, with some more uh, products and then uh, some more hunting footage. All right. Let's set it off the right way with this stalling kill shot. What the hell are these some bitches doing on the farm? Alright, we own a couple pigeons sitting out dead about 85 yards. Oh, definitely got a piece of them there. See if we can get on his homie. Oh, yeah, same thing. I'm hitting a couple clicks to the right. Except these terminators gonna drag them down regardless. Pigeons are strong fucking blades. They can travel 600 miles at 60 miles per hour without stopping for food or water. So these some bitches usually don't go down without a fight. Some bitches trying to walk it off. Ho! Oh, 85 yards running shot. King Terminator does it again. This son bitch Bressus is gonna be tainted into ground beef by the time I'm done with him. I don't think he'll be getting up after that one. His brain knowledge been scooped out by a terminator slug and done left the building. Looks like he lost a few IQ points there, boy. Now that's a big ass blade. Okay, see what we can salvage from these pigeon breasts. Some big ass blades for the pot, right there. Alright, let's get to work on some of the damn collar doves. Been switching between sun, hail, and rain all day today. Except we dialed in for this shit. Got three down from the tree, right there. Now that's a big ass exit hole for 22 cal. 20 grain. Got that much expansion in just about one inch. I got a couple of grain thieves posted up at 80 yards. We gonna play portrait as a judge, jury, an executioner. Oh, that one took a 19 grain Terminator slug straight to the gizzard. 
consider that your sentence, son. Yep, he a goner. I got to try to don't hit these uh, morning doves. Oh snap, threaded it in there. I got another one trying to walk it off at 75 yards. Take that there. You son bitch. Ish. Think my sniping location done been compromised. God damn. Oh snap. He's coming right at me. I got to put him down. He's gonna peck my eyeballs out. Whew. That was a close one. It's time to put this one to bed. That dove done got tight to mincemeat. Finish him. <laughs> now that was one tough some bitch. Terminator Slugs is capable of erasing the entire memory of a collar dove. I don't think there's much left in there. Avenger Tactical was sniping real nice today. Running on 20 grain Terminator slugs, 3D printed LDC, baffle kit, bottle bands we got all the terminator brand 3d printed pots for your needs okay this is what we got some breasts is looking good some's not looking too good <laughs> sip it's always good to breast these some bitches out confirm what these projectiles be doing and they's doing just what they's designed to do terminate This one here well, must have been that angry one that was charging me trying to peck my eyeballs out. Except that didn't turn out too good for him. Put a uh, thing up there and shoot at it. But I'm really impressed with these slugs. Terminator slugs. Terminate door slugs. By um, Idaho Air Guns and Outdoors. Very good. Very good. And they're hunting projectiles.